2023, why are you still attacking me right now? What did I do to you? Are you serious? So on the one week anniversary that I came to the, the mental health facility, right, I am right now in Texas City. Now, the, uh, the same, okay, so it wasn't Friday, because Friday is when I got, got the letter of death, and then, all because I had to be honest to tell my landlord, I told her that, and then she just blowed up on me, kicked me out. Then I was in the Salvation Army for one night. Then, this is the one week anniversary of me being here, okay? Then after all that progress, when Monday that I was calling different places, putting my applications on different wait lists, and, and stuff like that, and that was the way, and then uh, trying to find out what the heck happened to my uh, new Medicare, uh, Medicaid, and, um, and and food stamps, even though I had to wait for the 10, that looks like that's not going to happen, why, I tell you freaking why, because the Freedom Caucus got their way, and I'm going to tell you the truth, you remember back at the time, of the very stressful debt ceiling negotiations, the Freedom Caucus actually wanted the default because they couldn't get more concessions. They couldn't get more cuts. They couldn't get more money for the military like they actually do want it, like they even want it now. So they tried to vote on a continuing resolution. It was their own bill. It wasn't bipartisan. It wasn't the Democratic bill, but it was their own bill. And they rejected it. They rejected the path of old. So now we are in the yet heading into another shutdown. Okay. Now, mind you, the past few shutdowns that happened during my lifetime. Okay. I had one short one and I had one long one. But I always had income during the shutdown. Now the payments were, were protected. But then when you kick, kick off a payment or somebody just tried to, you know, like register for a social security card or somebody applying for benefits, that is going to be put on hold until uh, the government reopens. Now, under Trump, the government was shut down for 35 freaking days. 35 freaking days. I mean, it's bad enough that I had almost had a nervous breakdown that landed me here last week. Okay. Now, turn around. If it wasn't the death ceiling, the government shutdown got you. And right after they cut me off until next year, April made to be a that. I mean, this is this. this my God, it's never ending. It's never ending of 2023 assault on BT country. This is an assault. This is a total assault. I am angry. They rejected their own bill? You mean to tell me they did not pass their own CR or the Mutual with me continuing resolution bill, even if it's even if it means to have another thirty days for them to uh, work out their differences? Really? So now we're going into a government shutdown, and then the 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 the, the other the other caseworker, the other caseworker that was helping me to take the paperwork over to Social Security because they had other clients that, that they had the same issue or a different issue or whatever. But it's not only that. You can't even get a new Social Security card during the social, uh, government shutdown because Social Security is non-essential. It's only non-essential employees that won't be uh, working during the government shutdown. It's only essential employees. Oh, and some, did you know that some of them are not going to get paid? Did you know not even the military, the one that's supposed to be fighting for us, they're not going to have a paycheck? Okay? Do you mean to tell, you mean to tell, you mean to get, you had the calls at the worst point of my life when I'm sitting homeless in a mental, in a mental health uh, 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 facility? Okay? Sitting here. And then my two worst fears come true. One is the congresswoman who passed away when she was in her 90s. 
during the middle of our term, and then two, a party that 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 failed to vote for their own damn bill. They did not even vote for their own damn bill. No wonder why this country is divided. No wonder why this country is so damn divided. I guess the Freedom Caucus finally got their way. And then I still can't believe Trump supported it. He said that the if the the, uh, the Republicans don't get their, their the correct deal, he supports the government shutdown. It looks like they're going to get his way. Look like he's going to get his way. So people that people do get hurt during the government shutdown, y'all. People's lives are affected, y'all. Why don't you think? Just like back in the pandemic when we were forced to wear masks, couldn't breathe, glasses kept fogging up, couldn't hear to save my life. I mean, this is one thing another after this year is another. I was supposed to talk about they finally caught the the per, they finally caught the idiot, the bastard that that had Tupac Shakur killed. I was trying to talk about that, and later, or somehow in the middle of either sometime this week or before fast lane, I'm supposed to be doing fast lane prediction with the sheriff. And by the way, I have a message for um, Chief Justice Get Well Soon. Uh, Chief Fourth Justice have been having a cold, uh, and uh, he got sick last week. So uh, uh, my message to the Chief Justice is get well, get well soon. I know that you'll get back into bowling really soon. So, But anyway, I am hurt again. I am hurt again. I mean, this is ridiculous. This is absolutely absurd. Why? Why 2023? Why? Why uh, Why is this evil assault? Unbelievable. Unbelievable. I, the last time we had a government shutdown, we almost lost the air traffic control. We almost lost them. If we didn't have the air traffic control, plane can't fly. That means people won't be able to fly. They would have to probably crowd the, the, the either the Greyhound buses or crowd the uh, the Amtrak train if they had if they really had to get somewhere. I mean, that's a really ah! my fight for the overpayment is now on hold. Even at, even after even after Linda's go, uh, 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 Linda's going to be uh, taking or uh, took the paper to Social Security already. Now it's on hold. We're trapped in the government shutdown, all because the Republicans won't even vote on their own continuing resolution bill, on their own their own bill, their own bill, their own bill. Are you? Y'all heard of me. Y'all heard of me. This is why I'm not even Republican now. Besides the fact that uh, even though uh, Ms. Co- uh, Ms. McConnell didn't want to help us when he said he wasn't going to hurt uh, help us anymore by back in the pandemic. Now this is the real reason why I'm not a, a Republican. This is the real why, reason why I'm in the I've been hurt two weeks in a row. Two weeks in a row. One landed me while I'm here, and one just happened while I'm here. While I'm here. Are you, are you freaking insane? You happy? You got your wish? Did you know if I was outside, this, this still, there's still 90s here in Texas. There's some pockets of 90s up to 95 here in Texas. If I was outside in that high heat, I would have died. Did you know that? I'm prone to heat stroke. I'm ho- prone to heat exhaustion. Do you even care? No. No. But the cabinet does. The cabinet cares. The cabinet of the Big D country cares. Citizens of the Big D country cares if I live or die, but do I... I vote almost every time I can. I couldn't go vote first because I was almost going to vote in Galveston, but then I got kicked out. Now I not, I'm not even sure how, I'm not even going to show when I'm going to vote. But I'm going to remember this when I do be able to vote. I will remember this. I will remember this when I go to the ballot box. I will. I will. You can bet your bottom dollar. 
You hurting me when the, the least suspected. You hurting me. I can believe that. I supported some of your campaign. I voted for for some of y'all. And this is how you this is how you were paid the American people. You send a lot of money to Ukraine and other places, but you don't help, help the very people that elected you in the first damn place. Absolutely terrible. Absolutely terrible. You got inflation running up. You got gas prices going sky high. Potential p- prominent potential World War Three. What the hell is going on? Unbelievable. People's lives as I said, people gotta pay for kids' college, people gotta pay for mortgage, people gotta pay for rent, yada yada, in their government jobs. People with government jobs have family too. People who are single in government jobs have a life too, or try to have a life too. And yet people are having have a low income. We're just trying to survive. We're just trying to survive. Now you just made matters work, Freedom Caucus. I'm calling you out, Freedom Caucus. I'm calling you out, and then you threaten. Then you threaten. Um, 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 um Kevin McCarthy. You threaten to have him ousted as speaker and put one of your own. That that you make, make matters worse than that. To have your own little puppet, so you can put him on the screen. And I can do whatever the heck you want. Snap your finger, click your toe, click your heel, and they can do whatever the hell you want to make us even suffer more. Is that what you want? Well, congratulations, you just got it. And heard a lot of more people at the same time. Congratulations. You know what? The problem solvers is better than the Freedom Caucus any day of the goddamn way. Any day of the goddamn way. That's why I like the problem solvers. Because they're bipartisan and they know how to work together. They know how to work together over there in the so-called Congress. The Constitution needs to change. They need to have age limit, time limit. A term limit, and they need to have the know to have people care about their own damn constituents that even voted for them in a first damn place. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. This is Prince DJ. You just made me so mad that I, 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 wow. Wow, I am so ashamed of being a voter right now. I am so ashamed of being I mean I don't even have a party. I'm an independent I'm an independent voter. I am so ashamed of 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 what I used to be both a Democrat and Republican. I'm so ashamed of that now. And I am glad that I'm an independent voter. And I will remain an independent party, uh, uh, independent voter because y'all can't do nothing for me. I don't even have a representative in Congress. Y'all don't rep- represent me. You only represent yourselves. You only represent the rich. You only represent uh, corporations. You only represent the military. That all, uh, and you all represent other countries. That's all you represent. That's all you represent. I'll see you either later or sometime this week when we talk about WWE Fastlane. But let me let me let me tell you this. 2023, Kevin McCarthy, Freedom Caucus, the Republicans, the Democrats, you're all, you're fire!